So today is a very exciting day because it is my 16 week uh, prenatal appointment. So we are on our way to that. And the exciting thing is after this quick appointment, it's going to be, the next time I go will be for my 20 week ultrasound, which that's when we'll find out the gender of the baby. So we are excited. I'm so excited to get this appointment done. And the weeks are just flying by. Like I cannot believe how fast the weeks are going by. It's crazy. I can't believe I'm already almost 20 weeks. But anyways, we're on the road. Simi's chilling in the back. We got going kind of early this morning because I wanted to do some errands, just a few errands before my appointment. So it's going to be a busy day. But um, I just wanted to vlog today because it's, it's appointment day and I'm going to see maybe what I can vlog when I get in there. I, I don't vlog in pretty little appointments. I don't think they like bringing cameras in this specific hospital. I don't think they like like that. So I know every place is different across the country. But up here in Maine, things seem to be a little tighter than normal, I think, than maybe in the South. So I'm not gonna get people upset, so I'm not gonna try to vlog, like really vlog in there. But we'll see what I can do. I'm feeling great. I'm actually, I was 16 weeks a couple days ago, so I'm like 16 and a half weeks, getting close to 17 weeks. And I have movement, like I can feel like flutters. They say that's how it starts, like little movement. Like if I press on my stomach, I can feel movement in there. So I'm really excited because I feel like with Simeon, with my first baby, it was my first, so it took longer for things to, like for things to happen. Like I didn't, like at 20 weeks, I was hardly even showing at my gender reveal party. And I didn't feel movement to probably 22 or 24 weeks. It just took a lot longer. So I don't know. It's just really exciting. I guess things move along faster after you've already had a baby. So it's so exciting to be able to feel a little movement in there. I love it. And my bump, my bump is actually showing quite a bit. So we will vlog, maybe showing you a little bit of my bump today. So I, I haven't taken any pictures at all of my bump. So this will be like the first time we're actually vlogging it or taking a photo of it. This of 16 weeks. So with Simeon, it was like, I think I started at, I don't know, 11 or 12 weeks, even though there was really anything there. It's just different after you've had one. It's like, yeah, no, I don't think so. <laughs> so anyways, we are on our way to this appointment and I'll bring you guys along. I haven't eaten anything today because I want the weight to be good today on the scale. So I'm not gonna eat anything, try not to eat anything till after my appointment. And then I'll eat a good lunch, probably we'll get something. Chipotle kind of sounds good, don't you think, babe? I haven't had Chipotle forever, I don't know. It just that spicy kick just kind of sounds good. Wonder why. <laughs> I don't know. We ate Chipotle before we went in the hospital to deliver Simeon. We went and got Chipotle before we checked in. That was exciting. I can't go in because Simeon is not allowed in. We didn't get anybody to watch him. I've got to sit out in the car. That'll be the first. It's going to be a quick appointment, so it's, and we're not going to be in there long. It's just like a checkup, like my 16-week checkup, make sure everything's okay. They just check on the, check the heartbeat and stuff like that. It'll be pretty quick. You won't have to sit too long with Simeon and Nathan. <laughs> I love coming to these appointments, so it's kind of strange not going inside. Today's going to be an exciting day, and our goal is to try to take you all and vlog every single time that Cheyenne has an appointment, including, of course, another birth vlog, which is going to be great. It's just a really exciting time, like, just like having a second baby, just knowing Simeon's going to have a brother or sister is just exciting to me. Is that dad? No. They were seeing everybody today on the road. <laughs> Oh, it's so pretty, guys. The weather is like gonna peak. 55. 61. Woo! Yeah, it's gonna get 61 today, probably about one or two. That's so, good for Maine, by the way, everybody. That may not be great for where you live, but that's great here. And it's not, it's cloudy, but the sun is peaking through, so it's partly sunny. And the last few days have been just overcast, and it's been just so not fun. But I think the next few days are gonna be really sunny. That's what the weather forecast says. So I'm excited about that.
are at a park and as you can tell I just got some really great photos of Cheyenne and uh, some great video as well and we're right here in Augusta it's one of the best playgrounds of course it's free it's for the public one of the best playgrounds in the area and then on top of that you have this beautiful view and you have the town behind you across the river I wanted to take Cheyenne over here and get some photos and video for the vlog today while we're at it of course there's this awesome playground so Simeon's having the time of his life so it really just sort of like killing two birds with one stone just perfect so uh, that's what we've been doing and uh, it's turned out pretty good pretty happy with the photos pretty happy with the uh, video especially let me know in the comments do you like the slow-mo or the slow motion I certainly do and uh, it just makes everything more dramatic doesn't it so we're going to go to uh, a couple of stores before she has to go into her doctor's appointment so we're going to get going but uh, just wanted to let you know what we're doing and where we're at Play in the car for Dada? Uh oh, he's out. Uh -uh. It's locked, we can't get in it. Hey everyone, I just got out of my prenatal appointment. It was really fast, it was like 15 minutes. But I have misunderstood. I thought my ultrasound was like May 7th, but that was just a like a regular prenatal appointment. So they actually scheduled me for an ultrasound today. So that's gonna be on May 13th. Ah, so we she, find out the Actually, baby. May 6th is when I'm 20 weeks. I know. <laughs> May 6th is when I'm 20 weeks, but I guess they couldn't get me in for an ultrasound on that day. And that would have been the day after we got back from Georgia. So I'm thinking the 13th is going to be great to do that. And my parents will be home from their trip if they go on vacation. So May 13th is when we're going to have the anatomy ultrasound. And we're going to find out the gender. Yeah, baby. Yay. So appointment went good. The baby's heart rate was 145. Take a guess on what you think. 145. Hey. Woohoo! Listen, that heart rate business is not I accurate. I think that means boy, you guys. No, I listen, really do. listen to me. Listen. Simeon's was about that. that thing at me. <laughs> listen, everybody. My wife's heart rate is always low. Her blood <laughs> so pressure is low. She's healthy as an old horse. Okay. <laughs> All right. So if she's healthy and her heart rate's low and her blood pressure's low, then guess what? The baby's is going to be the same. So don't don't judge the heart rate. We'll just have to wait and see. But I don't know. I'm kind of changing my opinion. Like I always just felt like it was a girl, but I'm thinking my nah, good boy now. No, 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 no. It's a Chipotle kind of day for Cheyenne. I'm just gonna eat it. That looks really good. Okay. So everybody, I got cheese plus cheese. So it should be very cheesy. <laughs> Cheyenne sauces hers with sour cream. So we did vegetables and chicken and that's gonna be good. Hopefully. Thank you Lord for this food, amen. 